Yo, what's good? Let's check out the season finale for Slime Diaries. If you want to talk about anime and manga, follow me on Twitch and Twitter at Joe Freshest. Links in the description below. And the YouTuber things, like the video, comment, and subscribe to the channel with notifications on so you don't miss another one. And if you want to check out any of my reactions for this series, you can click this link right up here. It'll take you to the playlist with all of those reactions. And as always, links in the description below. Though I don't just do reactions for this series, I do reactions for tons of series. So if you want to check out any of those other series that I react to, come to the channel, click on the playlist, and I'm sure you'll find something that you will enjoy. Now, these episodes are much more episodic. Uh, that sounds so dumb to say, but I just mean that there's no real linear story so much as it's each individual episode centered around a theme with funny moments or wholesome moments or, or just moments about the characters that we've grown to love in the Tensura universe. So there's nothing really to go over, I, aside from the fact that the last episode was very Christmas themed. This one probably will be New Year's themed. That's my guess. So uh, without further ado, let's go check out the new episode. First New Year's since coming to this world. Yeah, figured. Figured it was a New Year, th new Year thing. What the fuck is that? Enjoying New Year's to the fullest. Oh, I didn't even read the... Is that the name of the episode? Oops. Hmm. <laughs> oh, I like her um, attire. What is that? What are these? They don't get it. They don't understand it at all. And they're just rocks I picked up. <laughs> yeah, the joke doesn't work because they don't understand the dropping of the ball and all, you know, New Year's. They don't get that. Uh oh. Oh my God. Don't lock your doors. Listen, if, if she. <laughs> If she's in your building or anywhere near it, just open all of your doors. Like, don't even close them, nothing. It's just, oh my God. She ain't got no chill, bro. Doubt. Doubt. I, I feel like most of us already know this, right? First shrine visit. Aw. Time to toss in re Great Rimuru's balls. It's himself. Wait, why couldn't they just put a sculpture, bro? They don't be having actual gods in, in these shrines. They have sculptures. Yo, my man does not have to sit there the entire time. <laughs> And they should have given him something to read. Body double. Smart. <laughs> he reading some fake shit. Oh, he got the best ones. He, he got the best one. He got the best one. Wait, wait, trade? <laughs> trade? Oh, these are all his fortunes? Yeah, this man got, how many fortunes he got? Bro, I'm trying to get some fortunes. He needs to chill, man. Tra share the fortune with everybody else. He's got like eight great fortunes. I want the fourth one though. All right, y'all are being so extra right now, bro. So extra. Then get wrecked. You get no fortune. No fortune for you. They're making little Rimuru's. Whoa. <laughs> Damn, dude. Damn, he actually did kill it. <laughs> oh, man.
Creation, progress, feasts. Ooh, I like that. I like that. I like that. Creation, progress, feasts. Well fed, well bred. I love that. I love that. That's great. Besties. Road. Let's go, Geld. Ah. All roads lead back to Geld. Okay, well, that's not entirely accurate, Gumta. Hey, who's is all ripped up? Wait, 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 wait. Devotion to the blade. I am one with the blade. I love that. Abundant crops. It's awesome. Dedication to research. Okay, okay, okay. I see that. Very nice. All of them very nice. Forged through many battles. I get that. Independence. Okay. One shot, one kill. <laughs> My dog. <laughs> My dog. One shot, one kill. Start a theater. Oh, Ranga. <laughs> Ranga destroyed his. Pawing at it, I assume. Dang. Hee <laughs> hee. Oh, man, lazy. I mean, he lives the life, dude. He just chills. Everyone takes care of everything. He just handles, like, major decisions. And even that, he just ends up passing on to other people. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. That kind of scared the fuck out of me. Oh, and now they're fighting, and she's some sort of... The Tempest Mochi Pounding Team. Okay, okay. You pound that mochi, big boys. <laughs> My mans. Kusabe, right? Uh, I'm probably wrong. Kurobe? Kurobe. Pound that mochi. Oh, yeah. There you go. Uh, it's beautiful. It's the best mochi you've ever eaten in your life, isn't it? Yo, my man's beard is growing, right? I swear it was never that long. Oh, Geld. Little goblin girl. So, hey. I wonder if they have ones of each other or themselves. Trainee! What's poppin'? Oh, shit. Wait, it's not gonna be as serious as we think, I think. I I'm pretty sure it's not gonna be that bad. Watch it be, it's gonna be like something really not that serious. Oh, I really thought it was just, she was just gonna say something that's very not so serious. Yo, is she on good? Why was her face blacked out like that? Kurobe! Oh, man. Oh, that's what happened. Damn. She got her ass whooped by Milam. Again. Oh, that'd be cool. Yeah. Aw. <laughs> That's kind of cute. I like the fact that she's a dragon there. Kids these days. I'm gonna eat some mochi ice cream. Blank ass book, bro. You gonna start writing in it or what, man? You were supposed to write all your adventures here. Instead, we're just watching them. That's so cool that he could just like swallow things and store them. Well, all right then. Uh, let's talk about some of the stuff from the episode. I mean, there's not really much to say when it comes to Slime Diaries. I think it's just more about its wholesome little moments, its funny moments, and uh, giving us a look into how some of the different characters that we're so fond of in this series react with one another, or rather interact with one another. Yeah. So this episode was themed around New Year's. Now we've had tons of other holidays this uh, season. We've also had tons of stuff just related to seasons. So we had like a spring thing, we had winter, we had, it was it was, it was really nice, but this episode focused around New Year's. The, he dropped a little ball in their hand and he made like the little New Year's dropping ball joke. They didn't understand it, obviously. And then visiting the first shrine, except the the deity that they are visiting is Rimuru. So he goes there 
does his little thing and then realizes it is him who is going to have to sit on the pedestal as everybody comes up and visits their shrine for the first time in the year. That's gotta be a fun day. But he decides to switch out with the body double, just plops a little Rimuru there. I mean, could always just make a stone statue. I think at the end of the episode, they were saying, why don't we just put a mochi on there and we just worship the mochi Rimuru. It's kind of funny. We get a Gabidu moment where it's around his fortune for the year and it's turns out it's all a joke that Rimuru wrote and he just happened to get that one joke uh, fortune, which was just a bunch of different fortunes that were all just like really good, like really, really good fortunes. And another thing with the Japanese culture, I'm assuming. What, what did Rimuru say was? I'm sorry, I'm a brick. I don't really remember these things. We all write our visions for this year with a brush. That's what they do. The first calligraphy, I believe it was. You write your vision for this year with brush and uh, everyone did theirs. Ranga's was like all torn up with paw because like, you know, the dog. And of course, to end this season, we've got Milim and Shion going at it again, just like during the harvest season. They're going at it this time about badminton, and obviously Shion takes an L. I mean, she took an L against Milim the, during the harvest one too, so damn, she really can't catch a break. And then we've got the stuff about the mochi, and Geld obviously makes the best mochi. Trainee shows up, she's talking about some serious shit, but I don't know how serious it really is. That was pretty much the entire episode. He, he goes over his slime book. All those pages, still blank. I'm just saying, I mean, like he couldn't even like scribble something on them, make it look like something was written. They're just blank pages. And he, he puts that away. He's like, well, now I've, I gotta make sure that I write in my diary for this year. So that was a nice little, it was a nice little episode to close out the series. It gave it like a nice closure, closing sort of feel as well, being about starting a new chapter as it's New Year's. I'm interested to see where this thing goes in the future with like a season two, season three. Will it always be after a season is aired because that would be kind of nice. I liked it as like a little reprieve between the two parts of season two because it was season two is really good. Uh, at least the first part was pretty interesting. I think the second part's supposed to be even better. And now that we've got some other characters, you know, like, oh man, I I'm excited. And actually, I'm going to start cutting up all of those season two episodes that I had already done for part one of season two and cut them up a little bit more and make sure that uh, Diana gets them uploaded onto the YouTube channel so you all can check out the reactions for the first part of season two. Hopefully I get them all done before the second part of season two airs. But if I don't, you know, I, I mean, I'll, I'll probably just rush the last few if, if I don't quite get them all done. So from here, leave a comment down below what your favorite moment from this final episode of Slime Diaries was. Was it something to do with Geld? Gabiru, Rimuru, was it the battle between uh, Milim and Shion? Just leave a comment, whichever was your favorite. And as always, if you enjoyed the video, then like the video and subscribe to the channel with notifications on so you don't miss another one. I do anime episode reactions as well as manhwa reactions and reviews on anime and manga when I catch up to or finish a series that I really enjoy. So if that sounds like the type of content that you might be interested in, then please do subscribe to the channel. And until next time, make sure you all keep it fresh. Peace.